Hey everybody, we're back with Fallout 76, and it's kind of been a while since we did one of these survival weapon unique rewards. There's a reason for that. Um, this is going to be a little bit of a rant. Well, not really. I don't really get angry at all, but the concept of a unique weapon you get from survival is really cool. The problem is, none of these weapons are unique. These are just weapons that you can get in-game with, with, with legendary prefixes you can get regularly by playing that are just named something special. And that's so boring. Like, the, the unique survival reward weapons should be actually unique weapons. You know, like, a weapon that I can't get regularly. Like, I don't know. Like, the stuff from the Creation Club from Fallout 4, like the gauze rifle, you know, the classic Fallout 3 New Vegas style gauze rifle that they added to the Creation Club? Put that in there. You own the models, right? You own everything from the Creation Club, even the stuff made by modders, where Bethesda owns it, right? You know, it doesn't even have to have unique animations. I just want a different rifle, or a different melee weapon, or, you know, take what's existing in-game and give it something that's more unique. Like, here. Where is it? Perfect Storm is the only weapon in this game that has the ability to launch incendiary rounds. Right? Do stuff like that for the survival reward weapons. Or, um, what's, what else? Make a radium rifle that fires 10mm instead of 45. You know, things that are actually unique. Alright, that's enough of that rant. On to reviewing this weapon. The Mechanic's Best Friend. Three-star legendary pipe wrench. Well, it's got, obviously, three things. It's got 40% more attack power damage, which is pretty good. Can't deny that. 30% more damage to robots. Which is situational. But there are a lot of robots in this game. And then plus one strength, which is not a bad thing. But it's also not very good. So yeah. It's made for a melee player who wants to hit robots. Or is having trouble with robots. Like, I don't know. Reviewing melee weapons is easy. It's like, hey... You walk up and you hit stuff with it. And that's all you do. They're all the same. One-handed ones are all the same and two-handed ones are all the same. Can't really speak much of this thing. I'm not a melee build on either of my characters. So yeah. We'll go hit stuff with it. Ah! Crap. The game froze. <laughs> 